This is Chief Yellow Horse, my boss and good friend. And he's going to tell you what this design is on this uh, rug here. Yeah, this is uh, what they call a, a Ye'i design in our Navajo way. It uh, is the four, uh, on every sacred mountain there's a female Ye'i, and, and these are female Ye'is. Over there you can see the chief is sitting with one of his people. He does a lot of weaving, and she brought in a rug that she wants us to sell for her. That's how they help support their family, by their craft. The chief looks like he's going to be buying that piece that she brought in. This is my aunt, uh, uh, Lillian Bahi. Uh, was Lillian Bahi, it's now Lillian Bizardi, and uh, she comes to visit me every once in a while. She's from Lukachukai, Arizona, which is about uh, 100 miles due north of where we're standing right now on the state line at Lupton, Arizona. And um, she comes to visit me, and then she also weaves rugs, and she brings the rug over so that we can... Uh, so that, uh, you know, it always brings me a rug. Here's one that she's been working on uh, approximately two months. Question mark. Uh -huh. And uh, it's a, what they call a pictorial rug. And uh, you, you see it has hogans and horses and other animals on it. Also, uh, she puts her name in, in it down here on the bottom. See, I don't know if I'm holding it properly, but she puts Lily B on it. And I have... A, a certain collection of these, and there I keep them for myself. I love them. And she used to make uh, 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 rugs with me when she was with me here on, in the area. She'd make rugs that had uh, uh, teepees on them and stuff, you know, things, other things that we had at the time. So it was a very nice, uh, very nice to see her every couple of months. She brings a rug over, uh, and of course uh, I pay her for them, and uh, that's living by making one of these uh, all wool Navajo rugs right from the sheep. She, have a, she has sheep. And, and That's made beautiful. Them. Yeah. Wonderful. Did you say it takes a couple of months to make one of these? Well, she probably don't work continuously on it, you know, but it takes a, uh, it's a very labor, labor intensive and uh, it's just a lots of, uh, lots of work going into making it, you know. Is it okay to ask? Just uh, what kind of price it would bring? Uh, or what they, they sell uh, for? Uh, they're uh, uh, a priceless, a pretty priceless type of weaving. Uh, the two months, figure it out the white man way. Five dollars an hour for two months is how much money? Mm -hmm. So you can figure it out that way. Yeah. Just be, say, uh, what... Uh, that would be less than two thousand dollars yeah. plus material. You just work and, and work and work. Just mm -hmm. years and years of labor. <laughs> That's the way it is on those. Mm -hmm. Is that a nice one? That's beautiful. Yeah, it is. Uh -huh. So uh, she's yeah. probably, she's with her grandson here now, and he's going to take her on to uh, a gallop, and then they're going to pick up more wool, and then she'll start making some more of these as she goes. <laughs> Ha, ha, ha.